So, Wolf versus Bowser. How do you feel about that? Wolf has to be careful because you can cross up a lot of characters with uh, Nair and Fair and not really have to respect them. But Bowser is one of the characters that have insane cross up protection. He has really good uh, shield option being up B and covers both sides of him. Ooh, but doing a, a flamethrower in that direction is probably not going to grant him any favors here. Oh, yeah, there's a laser going to rack up that quick 50 here. Oh, wow. Delayed Nair as well. Yeah, oh. Forward Air just reaching over the flamethrower there, too. Oh, yeah, full, full Forward Air. Kind of like a smaller version of Bowser's Fair, but um, also having that combo potential as well. Probably not going to nail that uh, tech chase situation, but we'll get the fair off stage. I like the fade back from Rafi there, not really being overzealous with his approach. Wow, that was a wild down B, but you know what? When you play heavy, you gotta, sometimes you got to throw out the wild stuff. So. Yeah, kind of. Especially when I, I definitely don't want Wolf on my behind at all. So taking him out as early as possible is probably not a bad bet. Oh, the Nair shouldn't be it, but the back air? No. Mm. I, I would imagine it's kind of hard to contest that up B with uh, back air. Plus. Ooh, okay, no tech zone, okay. Yeah, while well, K9 is being very aggressive off stage here. But, I mean, it is definitely paying off, so definitely worth it for K9. There's that rising fair into the uh, south. Ooh, man, big damage, 47% strength. Already. Seven combo, yeah. Link and he's at 47. Yeah, against heavies, you do not want to do... Uh, you, you, like, the rising fair into the grab is really, really good. You have to be mega careful, especially when you're a uh, juggle food like that. Oh, yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, on the ledge here. K9 just waiting it out. Gonna get the grab on the whiff punish here. <laughs> I like how he just throws up the laser from that distance. Just no fear shown whatsoever. It's a good situation, but K9 thought he was going to be in a block strike. Went for that forward tilt. Ooh, Rob's trying to do the boosted uh, forward tilt as well, but K9 not falling for it. And wow, K9 in such a commanding lead. Seriously. Now, uh, I'm curious, is there anything that uh, you get off of the disjoint of the, the laser? Like, can you combo into that if the laser doesn't hit, but the, the disjoint does? Are you talking about the blades on his gun? Yeah. No, you uh, you can't really get like combo anything from it, but it's just good damage. And usually, usually the blades will combo into the blaster shot itself. Excuse me. That makes sense. All uh, right now, uh, K9 had no problem really returning there, and he's at 141. Yeah, uh, Rafi's in a really bad position right now. Yo, Rafi gonna get three stock though. Is Rafi gonna get three stock? Possibly. Oh, he tried to go for the F smash. Uh, I respect it. You cursed that man. <laughs> I respect it. K9 tried to seal it out with the three dizzle. There's that back air. He's waiting for that. Nice and patient, too. Not being too crazy just because he has a lead like this. Oh, that was a serious whip from Rafi. Yeah. I, I feel like Cameron wanted to do a fair, but he got, like, the old buffer. And another grab here, down throw. Just for the damage. Uh, missing that nair. Yeah, he's definitely uh, going to pay the price for that one. Okay. Ooh, oh. Down B. Reverse. What a punish. Big, big damage. Oh, time to get off of that platform. Whiffing that forward air. Yeah, not too bad. Going to be back on the ledge, though. I like K9 just taking his time on the ledge, not committing too hard. I was expecting a back air. Yeah, I mean, he, he was facing the other direction, so he, he was just kind of waiting. Right, trying to get this up tilt going, but Rafi not falling into it here. That's not a bad idea. I don't think up tilt uh, wouldn't kill at this percentage. Oh, yeah, definitely would. Oh, there's a down tilt. No double jump here for Rafi. Oh, doesn't get the hard air, though. Making it hard. White. Just a landing catch. Oh, I like I like the roll through on that down air, but Robbie's sitting at 234% right now. Are we gonna be rage boys? Are we gonna make this comeback? <laughs> there is the back door to seal it out. K9 with the solid two stock. Now, I know everyone and their mother plays wolf, but I'm ashamed to not be able to admit that I don't know about up air. Does up air kill or is it just a straight up String you along till 100. It'll it'll kill it like maybe 160 ish or so. Ah, okay. Because I was looking uh, when Rafi was landing on the middle platform right above K9. I was wondering why he just didn't do it up there, just close it out. Yeah, I mean, he definitely could have maybe an input error, maybe just didn't feel like it. Mm. You know, I've actually never seen up there kill. Really? Mm -mm. No, I usually just see it as a combo tool and he just kills the back air or back throw. Ooh, wow. Flamethrower, wow. wow, that's a lot of pain. What? <laughs> that was so much damage. Okay, that's actually worth it. Yeah. Forward tilt, it's like a pretty standard combo here against the heavies. 
feel like it's a standard combo against just most characters. Just down throw into death attack, he gets everything. Yeah, it's a really good, uh, really good strength. Does more damage than the up throw forward air. Oh. Still probably worth doing. Just, uh, just as a mix up. Very nice, very nice. Hitting that laser with precision. And you know, he read the jump too. That was good from K9. K9 is so patient on the red side too. He's really committed to the air. He doesn't, he doesn't commit too much with these down throws and the miss tech. You can't be missing these techs first wolf or you're gonna get swiped. Oh yeah. Bowser wants to swipe him back, but that's not quite happening. We're back in the mid stage. Not anymore. Even with the platform, is the center stage not going to quite do it here. Yeah, heavy animal. Very nice. Ooh, no tech zone. Oh, this is not good for Rafi. Every time he misses those techs, something just catastrophic happens. Can't oh. to get the, uh, the down air there, but Rafi pushed out with that uh, up B. Man, and another grab here. Rafi taking even more damage. The F tilt to catch the landing. Yeah, down tilt is going to get that two frame. Ooh, maybe he tried to go for the uh, down air. Maybe he was trying to fake it too, but nonetheless, still ledge trapping here. Rafi cannot get a break. Finally, the side B will connect and he'll get a stop. Yeah, and I see that Rafi's starting to see how uh, K9 starts to uh, take him out from the when he's recovering. Like, he always throws that laser out, and Rafi's starting to get a handle on that. Oh, there's the F smash to try and catch the landing, but almost catching another F smash there for Rafi with the landing. Oh, this is no dump on, jump on K9. That was not a good way to land. And just like that, what? <gasps> oh. Okay, he's up here. Not getting the two frame. Oh, and there's a side B. Yeah, just That's like that. What an amazing stock from Rafi. Wow. Yeah, that flamethrower had a lot of implications. Oh, that jump. Back air, off stage here. No two frame for game. Wow, even with the drip back up in there, we're not safe on block there. Rafi, oh, trying to do this flamethrower, but the up smash does not connect. I don't even think that would have killed with no rage. Mm -hmm, I don't think so either. Okay. Ooh, I thought it was going to make that comeback for sure, Rafi. Okay, good spot dodge, good old double spot dodge. Yep, spot dodge is a very, very strong option in this game. Back throw, I don't think it would kill, yeah. Yeah, I think that forward throw might have been a little bit better, but uh, honestly, I don't think staling the back throw is really going to even matter at this point. Oh, oh my god. Wow. <laughs> wow, Rafi made that comeback arena. I, I feel like K9 had control over that side view. Because the, the, the person with lower percent has control. Hmm. Yeah, Did he just accidentally like hold out? I don't. Maybe it's different in this game, but dang, that was weird. Yeah, that was unfortunate for K9. But uh, I mean, the way that I saw K9 adapting, like for the most part, should be okay. We'll, we'll have to see what happens to K9. All right, so we're gonna have the same matchup here. You see what stage K9 goes to? Probably Pokemon Stadium. I yep. Pokemon Stadium. One, go. Right, one and one apiece. You know, I really have to respect how Rafi is just kind of taking the lasers like, man, he's kind of going in after he uh, gets hit with it. Okay, and the flamethrower just stopping uh, K9 from approaching. That's been really uh, messing his day up. Yeah, really good move. Oh, and these bears from Rafi. Not in that oh, yeah. Wow, he's trying to punish with the F smash there. Oh, almost catches the jump, but K9 a little too late for the punch. Okay, dash attack. In the sour spot of it, it seems. Yeah, he delayed it just a little bit. Ah. Oh, whiffing the back air. Now, okay, Rafi, when he uses the flamethrower, it tends to work out pretty well, but he's also been throwing it out in kind of strange scenarios. It's getting him into a little bit of trouble. Yeah, I mean, I, it's, it's like kind of worth the risk for. I mean, you are, you are heavy, so you can kind of take the damage, but yeah, it, it's hard. Mm. Oh, tries to hit him with an air there. Wow, catches the, the roll as well. Yeah, and Rafi just completely jumping over the lasers, and I'm pretty sure at this point, Kanan just starting to condition to do so. Okay, not quite getting. I, I seem to recall the last time uh, Kanan went for a two frame with that down tilt, he ended up getting side beat. That didn't work out too well. Okay, you gotta be careful with the forward tilt, not the second hit, not connecting, and wow, that down air as well. Forward throw, gonna get him off stage here. Can Rafi land the pair? Goes for the uh, neutral B here. Saves the double jump, and the. Uh, the last hit of the up, he is going to hit Rafi. Really good stuff. Really good pace.
Okay, that was an interesting uh, return to the state by Rafi with that uh, spot dodge back on the stage. Okay, good side B. Yeah, with the platform assist, that will be it. K9, they're going to lose that first stock. Now it's even two stocks apiece here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the discrepancy between the weight classes, uh, even when uh, Rafi was at 200, K9 at 140, it didn't really feel like that big of a deal. Big damage coming out from K9, and I think this lead trap is still going on right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Rafi needs to be careful with the slot dodges that he's been throwing out there in the air. I feel like uh, Wolf really likes to shark that. Okay. Oh, beautiful catch on the roll back there. God, forward smash would have killed, wouldn't it? Yeah. Uh, maybe. Depends on if you got, like, the, the sweet spot. Oh, missing that Nair. Okay, this is Rafi's chance to return. Wow, 150% and still not a single touch here on K9. Rafi is just stuck in potential match. They finally landed forward here, but just not enough to get up attack Google 3 on the okay. Nice chase, very nice chase. Instead of opting for the up air, he just uh, kind of chases it and goes for forward air. And right now, Rafi is doing such a good job of just living for so, so long. Oh. The up and pretty much now, K9 in kill percent right now. Oh yeah, definitely. Good up till, wow, that almost killed. But this rage is definitely gonna help. And at this point, like, the blaster kind of don't matter. Yeah, <laughs> not really. Hit. Try to get the two frame on the up tilt. Oh uh, yeah, this is fourth throw for the damage here. Get that uh, edge guard situation. But I think K9 made a little bit of a misinput there, but he managed to redeem himself there. Rothbard's opening this back to the 50 hit. Yeah, he's killing off the top. Okay, now Rafi's chasing now. I'm trying to go for that down smash, trying to get that really strong. Good shield, I'm very surprised he was able to shield that. And it's probably because of uh, his weight being up the fastball. Yeah. Okay, Rafters. Yeah, he's trying to evade and get as much damage as he can before he gets uh, inevitably side beat or something ridiculous. Oh, okay, first time I've seen the Nair come out. And uh, I'm not so sure. Uh, if Rafi's able to get some type of conversion off the of flamethrower, which I, it doesn't look like he should be able to get, but I don't know why he's throwing it out when he should be kill time. Nice, up to catching that jump. Yeah. Uh, so we're going to take it out here. Ooh, okay. No tech chase, no tech, man. Two no techs in a row. Not going to each. Yeah, he's rocking a lot of damage there. Nice, okay, speaking of damage, and this is definitely the time to start throwing at the flamethrower. That was good. Lots of shield damage. Charge with Nair, connects, but not fully here. Nice catch on the roll there. And I see these two players are starting to read each other's jumps, like right in the in the neutral, they're just jumping into each other! Oh. Down smash, catching Rafi. Sweep the legs, K9 S boost with the solid oh. deal. Rafi was bringing it back though. No, no, 2 1 2 1. Rafi did take a game. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he did. Yeah, that was a really uh, good set. Good yeah. set for both players. I liked how they were starting to read each other. That was, that was an interesting interaction by the two. Oh, man. I would do fair, and then my next fair would miss, and then I would die. I'm like, dude, I practiced this all the time. Hey, what happened with that side B in game two? Did, were you able to control that side B in game two? Yeah, were you just like, F it, I'm done? Wait, what you were you at lower percents, that's why. And he side B'd you, and you, 